What's up everyone, this is Max Simply Flower. Today I'm going to be talking about two amazing uh, Mac terminal hacks that have been released recently and um, they are iTunes Play Notifications uh, terminal hack and the Scrolling on Folder Doc terminal hack. I'm going to be showing you what do those terminal hacks do. So we're going to talk first about the iTunes Play Notification. So you're going to find two uh, download links in the description below uh, for those two zip files and uh, once you've downloaded them you're going to unzip the iTunes playing notification and I'm going to be showing you what does it do you're going to find two txt files one to show you how can you enable it and one to show you how can you disable it and of course you're going to need the terminal so um, all that you've got to do is to enable it is simply open up this txt file and copy this part completely okay command, uh, command C make sure you highlight it completely in that way and then uh, you paste it over here and it will be entered and the dock will be killed and everything. Fine. So what does it do? Let me give you a preview. Let us go to iTunes. Alright, so here we have iTunes. Now I'm going to open up a song. For example, where is my favorite band? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Yes, Egypt Central. For example, over and under. If I open up the song, now I'm going to disable the sound so that I don't lose copyright. If I open up the song over here, I'm going to get a notification over here from iTunes about the name of the artist and the name of the song. And this happens uh, anywhere, uh, wherever you are, except at uh, the dashboard. Um, uh, I mean, the notification you may get on iTunes or on any other full screen app or on your desktop, you just get it from right from here from iTunes. Like, if I change the song again, I'm going to get it over here the name of the artist and the name of the song. It's a, a really very good terminal hack. Uh, it's a very good because unfortunately, iTunes is not supported with Growl. So, uh, such a terminal hack is, of, is very useful and uh, it's very cool really and of course to disable it uh, open up this txt file and open up your terminal and copy this completely and um, and paste it in the terminal over here to disable this uh, feature but I don't advise you to do so it's really amazing okay so that's for the iTunes play notifications now we go for the scrolling on the dock so um, what does this terminal hack do is, uh, for example, if I go for um, the Mac installation files, usually I would press on it over here so that it would open up, but um, thanks to this terminal hack, there is no need to do that anymore. I may scroll up so that I can open it or scroll down, and the scrolling can be done on your magic mouse or on your trackpad or, or, any other scroll bar, uh, or any other scroller on any mouse. It's very good, really, and it works best with uh, Mac OS X line because um, because of the inverted scroll ups, which is the logical way of scrolling, really. So when you scroll up, it's going to open, and when you scroll down, it's going to close. I don't know; it may not be that helpful, but um, I find it cool. So uh, same thing over here. To enable it, you simply copy this and paste it in the terminal, and to disable it, you do the same thing. Well guys, that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. Please do not subscribe and if you have any comments, leave it below.